Okay. Still recording through my Bluetooth. Yay, you guys are hearing me. Where'd Striker go? You're still looking for him, aren't you? <coughs> Come on across. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. This is a reminder. She's coming to me like this because of what I'm doing right now. Offering peace. Now there's going to be moments where I'm not offering peace, like when I'm spanking her on the hip with a dressage whip, and when she gets all emotional. But I need to intersperse it with moments of peace so she can learn. No peace, no learning. Because this is when they're learning. Now there's a chance she might show me how she feels when I pick up this whip and leave. Did that surprise me? No. Because that's how strongly she feels. So, I'm going to ask her to change that. I'm going to put the whip down. I'm going to teach her it's okay. I don't know if she's going to come in all the way or not. Oh, gave me a gift because she gave me a gift. <clears throat> I'm going to respect her feelings. While I change them, I still got to respect her feelings. I threw the whip away because she gave to me. I need to give back. Good girl. You are so smart. Just all those feelings are in your way. It's okay. It's okay. Let's see what she does this time. Good girl. Yes, I am going to do some more work. There you go. Now she's responding with me, just pointing it at her. Somewhere in here, and hope oh, I need to actually touch her with it to ask her to go. <clears throat> the first time I spank her with this on her hip for balking at a stream or something, <clears throat> needs to not have full of emotions. Even right now, I'm just touching her with it while she moves. Yeah, I actually tapped her with it, and she had almost no reaction but to move forward. Okay, so now what I haven't done yet is worked on the word for the right front foot. That's going to be a direct rein with my right finger. When I apply my right finger in a direct rein fashion, as if I were in the saddle, I expect the right front foot to step toward me like that. It's not working as good as the left. Moving too fast for me to give her the room. There, 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 there. That was a good one. Best one yet. Because that one, she really gave me that right front foot. Going to give her a moment. Good girl. This is our little contract. You give me a good effort, and you give me the best you've done, I'm gonna give you peace. I'm actually giving her a release with every step with this finger. I'm taking it, when I see the foot step out, I release. 
while she's moving. I put it back in for the next step. So that little finger is giving and releasing with each step. So she is getting releases in between. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to tap her again. I don't want that to mean anything extra special hard. Her tail's telling me she doesn't like it. And hope. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. I'm not going to give her an extra special long break this time. A lot of peace because we didn't really do much. Good. I can ask for this left, right shoulder again. There, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a medium one. She needs to be walking forward. There's a good one. There's a good one. And I'm going to switch it to the right hip. Right hip come in, which she knows. But I'm going to emphasize it this time. There. Good one. Good one. Very nice. Oops. My helmet's in the trailer. I'm getting on this horse today. Yes, you heard me say that, didn't you? Okay. You're a good girl. Saddle's leaning to that side already. Not cool, because when I get in, it's going to need more. And I don't know how the length of these stirrups are set for me or not. One, two, three, four, get five on this side. One, two, three, four, five on this side. Okay. Seems a little long. Throw that up there <clears throat> so I can get my helmet. How long have we been working? Ah, two and a half hours. Come on. Yes, I do want you with me. Come on. <clears throat> so, I got standards for everything. I got three 10 second rules when it comes to mounting the horse. We're going to count to 10 together three times. First one is thou shalt stand at the mounting block next to me with the stirrup in the proper mounting position while I count to 10, we count to 10, and thou shalt not move any feet. If a horse can't do that, don't even think about getting on it. Better rump a whole lot. What I do, she's very sensitive back there anyhow. But if I my foot happens to brush the top of her rump as I'm swinging over, I don't need that horse scooting forward, bolting forward. 
So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. She passes then ten second rule. Second ten second rule. I shall be able to put half my weight in the left stirrup or the right stirrup without your head coming up. And I sh we shall count to ten one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The third one is once my ass hits this saddle, I'm gonna we're gonna count to ten one more time. <coughs> she is not to consider moving until we get to a count of ten. And then wait for my command to move. Good. And the best she's done perfect. She's got good somebody taught her some good things. Uh because she so, did so good, the best reward I can give her for showing me she knows her business is to not get on. She's nice and calm and relaxed. I don't see any problem with getting on this horse at all. I'm going to check my girth. Last thing you should do before you mount a horse. I'm going to come up here. Count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'm going to put half my weight in the stirrup. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll pick up the left rein, tilt her nose a little to the left, and grab mean, and she moved. She didn't move very far. I'm going to pick up the reins and ask for a step back. There you go. That's good. And her head's up a little. <coughs> She's overly emotional. Got some anxiety. So I'm going to help her out and get rid of it. Ain't no point in getting on a horse with anxiety. At the beginning, this is where you help the horse lose it. Once you get up there, it gets harder. Good girl. That's nice. I appreciate that. Thank you. You are thinking about me really hard, and I very much appreciate that. The only debate I have going inside my mind is when I mount her, am I just going to get off, or am I going to ask her to go? This horse has been ridden lots. So it's not like this should be a surprise or a problem for her. However, I'm thinking out of respect for her and, and to show her something. I'm not even sure what that thing is. I think I might end up just getting off of her immediately. And I think that might mean a lot to her. I can't tell you why I think that. Pick up this left rein again, tilt the nose inside, right there, grab hold of me, and swing that leg over. Holy crap, stirrups aren't even close. <laughs> now it also helps that the saddle's leaning a lot to that side, but I'm not sure who rode this last, it wasn't me. Interestingly, I put it up in my armpit. It felt okay. But it ain't. Okay. I wonder. I gotta put it all the way up there. Whew. The stirrup hob was almost too short. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm goofing around with the saddle. I'm going to have to get some different stirrup hobbles to put on this thing. Whew. I can't even get enough slack. guess I shouldn't be filming during all this while I'm goofing around. <clears throat> You're being very patient, thank you. I might need to get some pliers. There we go. Whew. 
this hole I got a feeling I put punched a bunch of extra holes in this. Oops, it's also twisted on this side, which made it shorter. So I'm gonna twist that. I'm sorry, you're doing good. <coughs> it's called buffoonery by your human. I might have to go turn off that video camera and turn it back on again before this file gets too long and big. That's better. I think I can fit that screw problem on there by not covering that another. Question is, do I need to go up to that last hole or not? Can't tell. <coughs> Maybe I've shrunk again. Probably. That screw problem is just too little for the signal. Huh. You're okay, good girl. I know I've got some new ones. I don't I think they're up in my tax shit now. Oh well. Interestingly, the strut hollow fits on the other side okay. Same way. Huh. <coughs> Good girl. Okay, I'm gonna go see if I got a longer one. I can pull off another saddle temporarily. I guess I better reset camera. <coughs> So you can just skip ahead to the next video now. 